All right, Esperanza, this is the Netflix drama The Crown. And the man who looks Pakistani is an actor playing a Pakistani doctor. He was assigned, which is also a doctor, honey. He's a surgeon. Doctor is very good. Could we not do this to Esperanza again? <laughs> Esperanza, I, I deeply apologize. <laughs> I just, I want to tell you about this, this uh, audio and introduce this audio. Do you have any other addendums before <laughs> I we go? Nope. Okay. Nope. So I, I have some free space here, supp supposedly. So, the his name's Khan. And that's, of course, Princess Diana. It's, that is actually Diana. The voices in the recording are the actor playing Khan and the actress playing Diana. And it's a... It, it, Diana tells this guy in their very first intimate conversation, I would very much like to go to Pakistan. I could live in Pakistan. And he says, you know, I think you would find the restrictions on women very restrictive. And then she answers with this restrictions that she faced in the royal family. It's a brilliantly written line. It's kind of funny because Hannah is watching it in the very last hours of being awake, so she's remembering some things that I, I, that I... Oh, now she, now she remembers this. I had begged her a half hour ago to find it for me. She claimed she couldn't. She didn't remember it. Ciao, ciao. It's a nice idea in theory. In practice, you might find traditional Pakistani values a little challenging. You think the family I married into is any different? I was instructed to dress modestly, speak in a lower voice, and walk one pace behind my husband and address him always as sir. I was discouraged from expressing opinions or having an education, and I had to make a vow that I was a virgin before being considered fit to marry him. All right, Esperanza, this is the Netflix drama The Crown. And the man who looks Pakistani is an actor playing a Pakistani doctor. He was assigned, which is also.